Reichel, head coach of All-Stars Gym here at the big show. Yes. Headlining this London card. Again, yes. Yeah. <laughs> How do you feel about headlining the show in Europe and not in Sweden? Well, it's, it's always a uh, nice having a headline, you know, uh, being the main event. So it doesn't matter where it is. But, you know... Being in Sweden is a uh, being in Sweden in front of all our uh, fans is amazing. But we appreciate every opportunity we get. And it sounds like Alex has been kind of hound, not hounded by the media, but it sounds like the media requirements, even though this is outside of Sweden, have been pretty, pretty, I don't know, extensive. Is that something you try to manage, and do you have to work around his media obligations? We try to have media days, so it's not every day that we have uh, media. We try to like, cram in everything in uh, on certain days, so it doesn't disturb his training. So we've been we've been quite good with that. Manos management, uh, Thomas and Manos have been, done a great job there. Uh, so it, it, it was good. Yeah. And what have you worked on since the John Jones fight? I mean, he flexed his wrestling skills, his striking looked on point as always. Where do you go from there in terms of your development? What can we expect? <laughs> is this yeah. something we have to ask you after the fight? Or? Yes, I, ask me after the fight, or you know, or watch during the fight. You know, but uh, he's ready. He's ready. He's gonna. We, we train extremely hard. We've had like uh, glory fighters coming in, uh, rank number four and number two in the world, sparring with Alex. So you know, we had quality, quality sparring. He hasn't won all the sparrings, so like, he hasn't gone always our way. And that's how it should be. So we're ready for this one. Do you handpick the guys that, that you bring? I mean, we've seen some different size guys, some big size guys, some more wrestlers. And are you the one, or is it the management team that handpicks these guys? I, I, I'm the one that uh, that says the final okay. But I have a good team around me, and uh, they help me uh, choose the guys that are coming, like uh, Mikey Shama. He's uh, been a great help in the camp, helping me uh, with all the sparring, taking care of the sparring and uh, helping us with the camp. So all the coaches of All Stars, uh, great coaches, uh, Manos management, all the staff, the first five, you know, everyone, everyone uh, has been a great help. We're a team, so uh, we work as a team. Okay. Two more questions for you. Yes. First, I think, I know you're not going to talk about game plans, but can we talk predictions for this fight? I think you've been pretty vocal, at least in terms of stating something of what you think may happen. Can you can you put anything out there on what you might think happened, how this might end? I hope for a stoppage, but I'll take a win, however it comes. Uh, so I don't care how, the, how we win, as long as we win. And we're gonna win. So for me, it's uh, it, it doesn't play any. It doesn't. It, it's it's not uh, significant how we win. As long as we win, you know, and uh, we're gonna win. Okay. Uh, let's switch a little bit to another guy you have training in, in your gym, Alir Latifi. Yes. How how has it been having two guys getting ready, same weight class for the same part? It's been fan actually. It's been fantastic because they feed off each other. They help each other. They push each other. They uh, work hard together. When one's feeling weak, the other pushes the other one, and vice versa. You know, so they've been like just feeding off each other and helping each other. So it's been a, it's been a pleasure uh, to work with all the guys from All Stars. We got 40 pro fighters there, and they all help each other. So uh, it's great having two guys on the same show, uh, getting ready for the for basically the, t the same type of fighters as well. Say, but both strikers that they're going to fight against. So it's been like uh, great, like having both of them and training them uh, together. And uh, yeah, they, we're, we're going to do the business on uh, on Saturday. Great. Well, good luck to you, coach. And always a pleasure talking with you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.